Hello all you awesome people out there, my name is Akira and welcome back to this episode of Let's This Let's Play of Logging in the Green Why did I call it an episode? Momo, why did I call it an episode? Because it's an episodic series with uh, character development and plot evolution and um Yeah, but what did I say? Welcome back to this episode Uh, because we've done this before no, that's not right. Yeah. I think the only solution <laughs> is that you uh, you're stupid. Gee, thanks. Anyways, <laughs> our mood is afraid, depressed, yielding, and lonely. Mostly yielding, though. Yeah, because yielding gives us um, bonuses in compose, uh, world demeanor, and economics. Oh right, yeah. We had to. Oh, I have a post-it note somewhere telling me what we have to do. Uh, it was uh, um, accounting. Accounting. That's as as high as it can go at the moment because this two is not over twenty-five. Yep. So let's take trade and production. Okay. And um, classes trade. I have a feeling that we were taking accounting before. <laughs> so trade and production. And then week 16 morning. <clears throat> the most important trade route in the domain is the Cavella River. It travels through the center of your land, uh, your lands and almost every duchy contains tributaries that feed uh, into the Cavella, allowing goods to be sh shipped <laughs> along it by the boat. Holy crap, I cannot read today. Well, it is Sunday when we're recording this, so... <laughs> <laughs> and week 16 afternoon. <clears throat> you learned that most of the domain's iron is mined in Sudbury and transported west by the Govan River to the Kavala. Well, that was in this one. You had unlocked a new outfit. Yay! Today is the precision and planning for the Festival of the Good Lady. Will you be leading the parade? If you have any concerns about your safety, please stay here. The people will recover from disappointment. If we lose you, there is no recovery. So, will you lead the parade? Will you parade and make a speech? Or would you rather not go? I will lead the parade. You will lead the parade. I don't think I have enough in speech to... Uh... Cheerful, willful and pressured plus. <laughs> I'm not... <clears throat> Sorry, I forgot what persona I was doing. <laughs> uh, one of the many illies. Yo! I'm no afraid of no parade. I'm going to be the best parade leader ever. Foo. My little girl. <laughs> you prepared your best gown for the occasion, then walked slowly through the town with the attendants. It would not be appropriate for you to wear a sword, but you do walk with a sturdy golden scepter that's taller than you are. Um, we said something. At the end of the route, you held the priestess turn over the earth for the new tree to be planted. Then the new life is blessed, and all the attendants is joined in song. The procession with groups to return to the castle. Well, that went uh, good. So, what did that change the mood? Not that much, actually. No. We are a little um, less yielding, but that's it. Because yeah. we got willful, but. So, uh, what did you want to do? Let's attend court. Sitting in the court is not fun at all, but it pleases your father and it might be important for your future. So, shall we check out our new outfit here? It's the... Tuxedo. Mm, yes, yes, quite. Mm. I look fabulous. <laughs> I take it. Okay. So... so let's take more economics. Oh, uh, accounting. Two accountings? No, just one. I think one should be enough. And then let's take one... Um, elegance. No, composure. In royal demeanor. So you want... Composure and... Accounting. Yes. Gosh. 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 
Anyways, week 17, morning. You learn about the concept of diminishing returns. A point after which spending more on a particular project fails to improve it as much as previous spending did. You study taxations and learn about how past monarchs demanded too much and drove peasants into ruin in order to collect it. Other monarchs demanded too little and drove whole domains into ruin by lacking the funds to sustain and defend them. And week 17 afternoon. You practice positive thinking, maintaining a good self-image and conditioning yourself to carry on uh, rather than be frustrated by any past missteps. You practice sitting calmly while your teacher circles around you and makes unexpected loud noises at random intervals. Are you ready for the Guan Ball? Yes, sir. I, my dance is like Waymax. And, and you have the beautiful outfit on. <laughs> like a sir. Like a sir. <laughs> oh god, our queen is going to be a man. <laughs> she will make a sex change and stuff. Well, what if I... What, what if I identify as a, as a man? No one takes care of my needs. Or my demands. How dare you? All the nobles in the domain are here <laughs> to see you. To see the queen. Queen! Bitch, I'm a king. <laughs> you finish dressing and descend the stairs to make a grand entrance. Please don't fail me too much! All around, the wits and powerful powers in the activities to gaze upon you, the ruler of them all. No! Um, I have a feeling you failed something. Break. Seeing yourself reflected in so many eyes made you want to run away and hide. Damn it. After a moment you force yourself to carry on, but you're sure they all seeing you hesitate. Your father waits for you at the bottom of the stairs in office and offers your his arm. The first dance is for us. He guides you gently around the dance floor, never rushing you. It's fun to dance with your father. But you look in his eye but the look in his eyes are so sad. After this you must choose your own partner. There are numbers of men who hope to catch your eye. The Dugo Kill alone has brought three uh, illibrate sons, all near your age. You look around the room at all the possible partners, which is to say everyone, no one may begin dancing until you do. You can pick who Whoever you want, and you will not be denied. So, someone about your age, someone younger than you, someone older than you, someone already married, or some scandalous. Someone younger than me. You may be, <laughs> you may be too young to hold the title on your own, right? But you are not <laughs> the youngest noble present. The honor falls on Adia. The young lord of Eleth, who is only twelve and a head shorter than you are. Next to him, you look passively adult. <laughs> Your little I buddy. Love him so much. So adorable. <clears throat> um, hi, Elodie. He looks absolutely terrified at the prospect of having to dance with a girl. But the little lord is too well barred uh, to refuse you. Still, you have to be careful not to step on him because he's very tiny. I will not step on him. <laughs> if My dance is. If it's just a. <laughs> and then. <laughs> dancing with a real partner feels quite different from dancing with your father. You know him, know his steps like a part of you. Now every move is a mystery. Yes! Of course, you are an excellent dancer. And you release your chance to show off your head earning skills. Oh, I've never played this part before, I can see. I have no skip button. <laughs> so not even myself had done this before. Unfortunately, your partner can't possibly keep up with your talent. And you end up tripping over each other. My fucking god. <laughs> I... Ah! <laughs> my dance is perfect! You I are actually idiot. succeed dancing and 
now he trips over me. Oh. Yeah, but at least it's not your fault this time. <gasps> oh well. <clears throat> Sorry. Between the dances, there are time for the guests to mangle. Mingle. Mangle. Mingle. <laughs> mingle. <laughs> mangle is something totally different. Yep. Chat and simply tiny bits of exquisite food. Um, you failed. Damn it! Doing a lull in the music. Banyan, the Duke of M Mure, uh, taps an elegant fingernail against a wine glass, letting the clean note ring out through the room. If I may have your attention, I believe we should offer our compliment to our lovely hostess. Her respect and tradition and the rights of the nobility means that we can all sleep safe in our beds. Our boundaries are strong and secure. Our land's well defended. No one would dare to steal from us. The bla uh -huh. the blatant uh, falseness of his words uh, grates on your ears. He's challenging you, uh, your honor, in front of the entire assembly. You keep your composure. <laughs> Yo, he wants to make me angry. He wants me to make a mistake. Who does he think he is? Tell him to do ignore his insult or his execution. Uh, yeah, ignore. I'm better than him. At least you didn't do the execution this time. <laughs> <laughs> that was something last time. I'm, I'm good. I, you turn I'm... your head away, pretending not to notice the concerned mumbers around you. Better to look like a coward than to endure in pointless fighting, right? As the gal continues, you take the opportunity to observe nobles that you rarely see. There's Gwynel, uh, the instance, the young lady of Sudbury, only a month older than you, and due to finally inherit control of the Dutch soon. Or Adele, the youngest uh, daughter of the Duchess of Liliha, and a f uh, fierce sportswoman. She was a few years ahead of you in school. And the absolute terror of the ball fields. No, Bre uh, Brioni. She had said her parents were leaving her stuck in school this season. Her parents are here dancing together. The Duke Constor close. <laughs> the Duke Constor's consort, clutching his duchess perceptibly tight. Um, strange that there's no sign of your cousins, though. Shouldn't they be here? Your aunt and uncle are here, of course. It would be scandalous if they hadn't come. Marvel being so close by. Uh, since magic failed, Damn it. it's nice to be able to enjoy time with friends and family, isn't it? Whew. That went well. Visit the treasury. Okay. I think we are good now. Accounting success. Yes. You overwhelm the guard with f uh, facts and figures, explaining that you need treasury access to adjust the royal budget, which may afford the pay packets as well as the taxes assist assisted on the field uh, on the friends and family they stand aside. Oh God. Uh, the glitter and dazzling, uh, but some sixth sense draws you towards the little lock box in particular. This is what you need. This is the crystal that will make you a lumen. You truck the box into your pocket. You can show it to your mentor later and get instruction on what to do next. Yes. Well, success. <laughs> yep, and our mood is like this. So. Still using. So, what do you want? Uh, let's take. Um, I actually want to uh, take some faith. You want some faith? Faith. So Let's take uh, law and divination. Faith, faith, law and divination. Week 18 morning. Only a lumen can channel, uh, channel magic and only with the help of an attuned crystal. The ability to control a crystal seems to be inherited, 
So crystals can be possessed, uh, possessed, can be passed from parent to child upon the lumen's death. And afternoon. You learn that the gods cannot be forced to divulge information about the future, and that the most powerful omens are those which arrive unexpectedly. You wander downstairs to visit your father and talk about the latest events of in the domain. You're moving with such enthusiasm that you didn't realize your father isn't alone until it's too late to avoid him and his companion. Ah, oh, right, her. <clears throat> you like to kind just land. Contrast Syrian, not a member of your cir uh, circles. She's a bit more than a decade uh, your senior, far too old to have ever been your friend, and yet not at all old as no noblewoman go. She has two minor titles, no husband and your father's arm in her gasp. How dare she make a move on your father? Um... So, what do you want to try? I really need a kind of ignore her possibility. Because I know insulting her or shaming her with silence gone will probably fail because I don't have composure enough. But yeah, shame her with silence gone. You meet her eyes and imagine your mother's disapproving presence behind you. Uh, presence failed. She noticed you stare but only smiles at you. Uh, at you even so sweetly. Darling Elodie, I hope you have been well. Her voice changed. Yeah, a little. <laughs> Fine. Perhaps we'll be seeing more of each other in the future. Yes. 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 No, 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 no. She so yes. gives you a little rave and it sits. Boop, 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 boop. And now she's gone. <laughs> Once she's gone, you raise an eyebrow at your father. Don't give me that look. Young lady, she's a nice woman, nothing more. She was the D! Ow, my oh my ears! <laughs> <laughs> and it's not going to happen anytime soon. Good. Not that it don't, don't not that it won't happen though. You should be careful how you deal with people like Siren. You need the goodwill of your noble as well as your commoners. Um, they like haven't been any problems so far, so I'm good. Many dark look, uh, many dark looks were aimed your way at the gala. As queen, you must be aware of everything around you. Momo, sorry, I thought I heard heard music. Oh, well, <clears throat> I, I am <laughs> I am paying attention to what's around me. Some people hear voices. Momo hears music. <laughs> I don't know. I think it's some so, of my neighbors that are being loud. I, I, I'm guessing you want to visit Jocelyn and uh, Juliana. Uh, nah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Jocelyn, why did I call her that? It's Ursel. No, uh, Juliana. Juliana. Of, it's Juliana of Ursel. I got it! Yo. <laughs> I got it! Yo. <laughs> Yo, what do I do now, dude? <clears throat> Pick up the crystal with your bare hands, press it against your chest, over your heart, and say, Illuminate! Well, she got a new voice too. Illuminate! <laughs> no, actually, you changed her voice for this playthrough. Yeah. <laughs> and now you gave me the old voice again. I, I can't remember what I gave her. For I voice. can't either. <laughs> it's so long! Uh, don't do it or do it. Mm, do it. Just do it! Don't let your dreams be dreams. Don't let your crystals be crystals. <laughs> Yo, here we go. Illuminate. Magical gold transformation scene. Wow. Well, something like that. It's kind of just boop. <laughs> Willful and cheerful. You feel dizzy and both legs and uh, <laughs> And both lighter and larger and lighter than you were before. The crystal has this. The cr 
I will take that once more time, okay? Mm -hmm. You feel dizzy and both larger and lighter than you were before. The crystal has disappeared from you. But you know where it is. Wow, dude. Ah, what voice did I give her? I can't remember. Oh, God, either. Ah, I want to use a new voice. Um, oh well, she will get a new voice, new new voice. Next um, time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she will get a new new voice. Yeah, like because I can't remember what <laughs> voice I gave her for this. So oh, okay, her voice is all over the place. Ah, uh, what should that voice be? Something uh, you can remember to begin with. I just stick with the old voice. <clears throat> <laughs> the priestess here is a friend of mine. I will come to your lessons in faith and train you to use your powers. Wait, what? That's not her old voice. No, <laughs> I changed my mind. <laughs> now she's more sounding like uh, the musician. <laughs> she is kind of Scottish, yeah. So. Um, mood has changed a lot. We are still yielding though, so. Yeah, we need to get unyielding because we need <laughs> to get some Lumen powers. <laughs> what are we talking about? <laughs> uh, let's take more faith for the time being. So, meditation. Meditation and, and law. You want meditation and a law. Ish. Week 19 morning. You practice assuming a sitting position that allows you to. Be relaxed and tranquil without being so relaxed that you are likely to fall asleep. And afternoon. Half the all of six. <laughs> the kings and queens of Nova have all been lumens for centuries. But in modern times, magic is only used for ceremonial occasions and the direst of emergencies. Long, long ago, the continent of Borealis was ruled over by a single witch king. Until a rival line of lumens challenged for the crown. The result, uh, resulting war went on for a hundred years with powerful spells and damages uh, that damaged the land so badly that even now no plants will grow. So. It is a time of the year to decide any necessary adjustment to the royal budget. The majority of the money we receive is already spoken for. But there's always some room for the discretion. Oh yeah. Based on the record and notes of current expenditure. Why can't I read that word? I don't know. Expenditures, I think. Expenditures. Expenditures. If you maintain the current rate of tax. You will still have nine thousand nine hundred and ninety-four gold, le uh, gold, uh, lessy, and nine silver talisy available for special project. You can imagine any re you can't imagine any reason that you would need to spend so much. You could afford to lower the taxes. Logistic fail trade success. Any little trade uh, disruption. Shouldn't need more than a few hundred uh, lassies to sort out, at least temporary. So raise taxes, keep taxes the same, or lower them. Keep them the same. Yo, I think they're fine as they are, dude. No need to change. As you wish. I think I chose the wrong one. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> so what do you do? Um, you didn't want to be yielding anymore, so... Oh, and I will uh, actually that will quickly check what I need to get to get the. <laughs> Weird. Uh, I think it's um, cheerful. Let's see. It is willful. I was close, so we have to get yielding the other way. Yep. So what gives most? What gets most willful? This one gives um, two plus yield willful. Yeah, let's take that. Uh, I just have to check lonely, though it will give us uh, loneliness. Oh, that's good, because then lonely can get down, so this yep. can get over. Perfect. So we are going to sneak out. It's perfect. You sneak out of the castle to have a little fun. You enjoy the freedom, but your father won't like it. Let's find out. Which it won't. So, our last week. For this session. 
Um, we're still healing though. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's take meditation and divination. Um, okay. Uh, meditation and deviation. Week 20 morning. <clears throat> you close your eyes and relax every muscle of your body in, in turn. Letting that feeling travel down through you from your head to your fingertips and toes. You take slow deep breaths. Letting that air move through your body. Feeling it give you life and energy. And afternoon. Dropping your favorite plate is bad luck. A statue spontaneously shattering is bad omen. You, sh uh, you read about well-known signs of bad fortune. Wells turning sour, dry light, lightning, uh, strange fish caught in nets, malformed babies being born, and so on. Okay, that was dark. <laughs> yep. You have unlocked a new outfit. You are requested to stand in judgment. A man has been convinced of the murder, uh, murder by standling of his wife. He does not deny the act, but requests a pardon that he might be set free. If you admit you killed your wife, why do you think I'm going to set you free? Save me, your majesty. It was my fault. The demons made me do it. Everyone knows the power of the magical beast. <laughs> they used me. They twisted my finger into chains. My, my wife found me screaming. She tried to shake me, and the chains wrapped around her. I need the priestess to bless me and make me clean again. Since Demons. magic fails. Demons that make you attack people? Is that even possible? <gasps> it's like magic. Is that possible? So, Pardon him. What? Pardon him. Look at the priest. I first. am very sorry for your loss, dude. The monsters are responsible, not you. Don't blame yourself. The priestess of the royal grove will take care of purifying you. Bless you, your majesty. <laughs> I mean, um... But... <laughs> well, I know something you don't. Uh, yeah, well... Sneak out! But I don't think I should spoil it for you. Eh, I will find out eventually, I guess. He's a human. No shit, dude. <laughs> <laughs> you sneak out of the castle to have a little fun. You enjoy your freedom. And your father will probably like uh, not like it. But he will never find out. So we got a new outfit and we got the um, priestess robe. Yes, that is cute. I like it. I like it. Keep it. Okay. So adorable. So, but that was um, another five weeks and we're still alive. We are still alive. Do, 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 do. We are still alive. Um, Momo, well, you know that every time you song that song, we died in the episode afterwards. No. Most of the time. No. Because that is not the same song. Every time you sing something about being not dead or alive. We are soon dead yet. Do, 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 do. Wait, what? See, that's reverse jinxing. Now I'm using con counter psychology on it. I don't think that's how it works. Aww. But okay. <laughs> I will not judge you anymore. So, but um, yeah, we will take another five weeks in the next episode, so I hope you all will look forward to that. Please make sure to go check out Strawberry Repair's channel, there will be an annotation at the end of the video, or there are links down in the description below for that. Just do it! No, really, don't. Do it! <laughs> don't let your subscriptions be subscriptions! What should it be else if they don't have to be subscriptions? I can't talk. Uh, subscriptions. <laughs> totally do subscriptions, just be just subscriptions. But if they aren't, what should they then be? Uh, don't let your thumbs be untouched. Uh, Press that like button. Uh, more, more, I, I, I don't think that. Just stop it. I tried to be motivational, dude. Yeah. I yeah. really tried. Uh, you can um, practice on it for the next time. Damn it. Okay. Okay. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. You can give it a thumb up if you did. You can... I tried that again. You can give this video a... F I hope you... <laughs> <laughs> you 
Are you okay? okay? No. Are you okay there? <laughs> okay, I think I have it now. I hope you enjoyed this video. You can give it a thumb up if you did. You can hit me up on Facebook or Twitter or write a comment down below. You can subscribe for more awesome videos. And I hope you all will have an awesome day. So until next time. Farewell. Farewell.